Hello everyone, or anyone who's watching. Uh, welcome to another break of mine. This is a 1990 Fleer basketball break. Um, these are junk, junk era boxes. I'm breaking them in hopes of finding a Jordan um, that can maybe get graded or one or two. Here's the base Jordan and here is the all-star. Um, they're hard to find centered, but if I can just find one or two of those cards or maybe more in these boxes then it will make purchasing these packs these boxes worth it because these boxes are pretty inexpensive um, hopefully they would have to hopefully be nine or hopefully be ten graded cards at the worst nine but ten would be ideal so these are kind of a throwback from when I was a kid when you say wax packs, these are actually real wax. There's 36 packs per box, but I think you can fly through them quite quickly. Um, yeah, these are definitely a throwback. They're fun to see. But I've got my sleeves ready in case I run across one of these Jordans. Drop them in there. They look to be in fine condition. I was a little worried that the corners might be Corners might have got hit in that box because they're not very well protected, but they look to be in fine condition. I might go through these later and see if there's anything else worth any money. But Michael Jordan is what we're looking for. These would be fourth year Jordans. See an all-star coming up there. Scotty Pippen, I'll pull that out. I'm, I was also a Jordan fan and a, and a Bulls fan. So, and collecting Jordans is a, something I love doing. And it's also a decent investment, I think. Jordan, can't go wrong with the Jordan card. Yeah, Dumars. I live in Michigan, so. Used to seeing Dumars and Isaiah Thomas. Those guys would be in here. Dennis Rodman, Jeff Malone, traded to Utah. There's a checklist. Carl Malone. Come on, Jordan, where are you? I'm just looking at the teams. Just looking for that Bulls logo. The top right corner there. I figure I should hit. I know I do Myers. I figure I should hit um, Bill Cartwright from the Bulls. I figure I should hit a couple of. Jordans out of these 36 packs. I remember going to those Bulls games at the old Chicago Stadium during their first three championship run. Sitting bleacher seats, John Paxson, Magic Johnson, All-Star. Great three-point shooter for the Bulls, John Paxson. The Bulls always had a great three-point shooter. Steve Kerr, John Paxson, Craig Hodges. The way that there's a Michael Jordan right there. Look at that. I see a slight printing, a slight flaw right there. But I will drop that into a... Leave there for further, for further examination later. Here is a Jordan right there. Very nice. Okay, get a couple more maybe. Centering on that card is pretty good. I think the corners are good. 
there's just that slight dot on there. <clears throat> Look at these Jordans once we're done here. Steve Kerr, another soon, soon to be bowl leader on in his life, then to be Spur, then to be coach, champion every which step of the way. Oh, there's Rod uh, Rodman, trade to Chicago. Hmm. Dennis Hobson, I'm sorry. I thought Rodman, but keep that on the side there. Didn't. Well, I guess maybe I knew Steve Kerr played for the Cavs. Of course, it says league leader in three-point accuracy. Even back then. There's a Glenn Rice, a Michigan fan. Won the, was a big part of the 1989 Michigan NCAA championship team. There's a Magic Johnson, Craig Hodges, as I mentioned, another great Bulls three-point shooter, and a Glenn Rice. I believe that's a rookie. Yeah, maybe a second year. There's Ron Harper. He replaced Jordan. Horse Grant. Very Horace Grant left the Bulls to go play with the Magic and Shaq and Penny Hardaway. He thought he was leaving for greener grass. But then the Bulls, that team didn't work out. And the Bulls won three more championships. John Paxson again. Patrick Ewing All-Star. Moses Malone, Reggie Miller, Jordan's nemesis. Some great showdowns in the 90s of Miller and Jordan. Pippin. I like these packs because you can easily open them and without having to worry about catching the corners of the cards. Sometimes I feel like I have two cards here. Sometimes I do have two cards. I'm gonna grab them. Kim Olajuwon, what year was that? He had been in the league, Spud Webb. I think he was the shortest player in NBA history, unless that's been replaced. Tim Chambers, Tom Chambers, rookie card. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry, all-star card. Dennis Rodman again. Cliff Robinson. Some of these cards just stick together a little bit. I didn't miss a Jordan. I have to look over some of these again. Body. Bill Cartwright. 
Bill Kreitler is quite something. He's a funny guy with a weird voice. The Knicks traded him to the Bulls after they drafted um, Patrick Ewing and realized they had a better center in Ewing. Joe Dumar is third in the back. Kurt Rambis. Isaiah Thomas. Might have been our first Thomas, unless I missed one. James Worthy. Will Purdue. Another one of the Bulls centers. They would trot out Cartwright, Purdue, um, Stacy King. I think Phil Jackson's Joe Dumars. Phil Jackson's triangle offense. With the Bulls, they never had a dominant center. Bernard King. Chris Mullen. Checklist. John Stockton. Yeah, we'll set the Stockton aside. James Worthy, Will Purdue, nice John Stockton All-Star card. Bill Lambeer, grabbing these little pistons, and Michael Jordan. That's a nice card too, him throwing it down. Sickly, Larry Nance, David, David Robinson. It's got to be his second second year. Yep, Robinson's second year. Okay, there's the whole stack. Maybe I can put together a set here and sell it for five bucks. So, 18 packs, two Jordans. Seems about right. Ron Harper. Reggie Miller. And horse cramp from the Bulls. See that Bulls logo. Gets me a little excited. And I'm thinking I might break this into two videos. Because this is going long. Because it's 30 six packs. They don't make boxes like these anymore, do they? John Stockton. Isaiah Thomas. Will Purdue. I'll set aside the Will Purdue, but not the Thomas. Being a Bulls fan, Thomas and Jordan, not friends. Thomas was fr is from Chicago. And always had a deep problem with Jordan. Because that's what they say. And also a little biased. And I think Jordan would get under his skin. But that was Jordan's game. Tim Hardaway. Part of Jordan's game was talking and getting in someone's head 
getting under their skin, so to speak. Get them to play out of their game. Michael Jordan! I'll look closer because they all seem to have that little uh, dot there. But besides that, these cards seem to be in pristine shape. We will look at those closer. Body. Cartwright. Kevin Edwards. Craig Evo. Michael Cage. Keep looking because I feel like I have two cards some of these times. Sam Bowie. Laylock. Neat bowl. When I was that age, he used to remind there was a guy named Bowl on a show called Night Court. And he was a security guard. He was funny. And now there's a basketball rookie, Larry Bird. I'm going to pull him aside. I'm sure I've missed a bird before, but that's the first one I noticed. Mark McGuire. Apply the Glagby Chexler. BJ Armstrong, how about that? BJ Armstrong, point guard for the Bulls in that first couple of championship runs. Controversial move, there was an expansion, I think, to the Charlotte Hornets and um, another team or two. Maybe the Toronto Raptors and teams can only protect so many players and it was an opportunity for them to let go of players and the Bulls uh, let go of BG Armstrong and I think he was the first pick in the expansion draft of these expansion teams being able to pick out players that teams decided not to protect and he was a player that you would could say Jordan made better. Michael Jordan, again. Okay, that makes four out of this box. <clears throat> David Robinson, second year. Fat Lever. William Lambier Jr. in the back. Tim Hardaway. Melagevon. <clears throat> Notice these are the cards where you can maybe see the players' names on the front and back. And the boxes are also not sealed in plastic. I don't think any of these clears were. So someone could potentially look for that Jordan on the front or back before selling the box. I bet that has happened. But this happened one time, the eight million of these boxes that were produced. Jim Paxson, that was John Paxson's dad. You can see he looks a lot like him. I didn't know they played in the league at the same time. Interesting. I remember when he played from the Bulls, uh, and there's John Paxson, uh, in a Patrick Ewing All-Star. I'm just going to pull up the father's son, because 
It's dead. Jim Paxson. Um, would make an appearance. You'd hear about him from time to time. But... Um, yeah. Are they brothers? They gotta be brothers, rather. Because Jim was born in 57, and John was born in 60. Yeah, they were brothers. Similar players, though. These are interesting things to look at. They didn't even keep track of three-pointers during that era. How interesting. Not many players shot threes. John Paxson was the best three, one of the best three-point shooters of all time. One of the cards back there said leader in three-point shooter percentage. Danny Manning. That was shrimp. Kevin Johnson, KJ. The Bulls beat KJ and the Suns. The Charles Barkley uh, en route to their... I want to say that was their first NBA championship. It might have been their second. Steve Kerr again. Um, oh, three-point accuracy leader by Steve Kerr. Not John Paxson, as I previously mentioned. I still remember that play when Horace Grant blocked Kevin Johnson at the end of the game from the Bulls. And John Paxson had made a three to, for them to take a lead by two, by one. And then Horace Grant blocked Kevin Johnson right around the free throw line as he pulled up for a shot. And the Bulls won. I believe that was their first championship. Seemed to be followed by Michael Jordan holding the trophy and crying and bawling. Picture that we've all seen. Image that we've all remember. Isaiah Thomas, All Star. Mark Eaton. Malone. Reggie Miller. Last pack here. Morris Grant. Curtis Ellison. Okay. So we pulled four Jordans here. Seem to be in pretty good condition. Uh, centering seems to be pretty good on all four. All four do have that little spot. And I will look closer to see if that's common or not. But um, besides that, they look to be in nice condition. So thank you for watching. I'm going to open this other box in another video. And you can watch that one too. Thank you very much.